before, in one of our sessions, you answered this question uh, about uh, Zolin and Dolin. So, Huzu said uh, that time that pronunciation of this word is um, uh, uh, between these two words, uh, Zolin and Dolin. So, he exactly wants to know how can I correctly pronounce it. I think he should go to some Arab teacher <laughs> and find out how they twist their tongue when they say Dwad. So it's not Dal, it's not Zwad. It's in between the two. And the tongue is slightly twisted when you say. So I'll, I always try to say Dwalin in the same sense that it's not Dal, it's something between the Zwad and the Dal. Now, you have, must have noticed that Shokat's throat seems to be in perfect order. Eh? And uh, I wonder if she has prepared any song for us today or not. It's after the Eid, first meeting. So if she has, we should love to hear her voice. She's supposed to, isn't it? She's supposed to? Good. Yes. Whatever you like, it's up to you entirely. Allah
हरे शमान दुखो बैठा कन्ना शी शोभी तारीदान अल्लाह मोहन माशाल्लाह बहुत ही मेलोडियस वाइस है इट्स ब्यूटीफुल I was afraid that she would lullaby us to sleep. <laughs> the the song is such, as you know, you feel sleepy when you listen yeah. to it. And she has done very well today, tonight, mashallah. I wish we had more time so that we could also talk, ask these two brothers okay. to sing. But we have no not much time left because you have prepared for the mishti as well. So I think it is hardly time left for mishti. Should we prefer to hear their song or eat mishti? Which what would you prefer? <laughs> it was your say, is it? Eh? Whatever is your instruction. So no, I'm, I'm I'm not very fond of mishti, but I know you have done it and Jee. you have prepared the feast. Jee. So you Jee. have a right to for you have a right to serve the mishti now Jee. Okay. because there is little time left. Jee. to now in the prayer ji are bhai please mere bhai bring the mishti the children are waiting impatiently for this sir huh? i've been listening to i've been listening to old tapes the sets of yours as well ha huh? mashallah but in the urdu class i have to disturb you repeatedly for the sake of translation to others you know so this continuous listening is much better than in the urdu class where i have to tell even bada <laughs> bachcha the meaning you know and every time you are disturbed but you understand why it was so in the urdu class eh? but this time there was no disturbance it's a beautiful song Bengali is a very sweet language. Although I couldn't understand properly all the wording, occasionally I got glimpses of some. But uh, the Bengali language in itself is very sweet, and God has blessed this language with a special, special mellow sweetness. You huh? Bengali, sir, do you agree? Huh? Yes. Yes. So come on, let's have mystery now.